Fuji. What's up, Tesla community? So it's midnight and I'm about to head back out of my car because I just found out from my friend Brooks at Drag Times that this new Tesla software update, version 2020.12.5, not only gave us a new Leopard kind of crouch mode for launch control, it also gave us almost an additional 50 horsepower for the Performance Model S. So check it out here, I got the car all heated up, the battery's at 100%. Let's go find out what this baby can do. So real quick before I head out, I'm gonna do a controlled test here in my garage so you can see just how much the front suspension lowers when you activate launch control. Here's one thing to keep in mind too, for launch control to work, suspension has to be set to low. And until it gets down to low, it will not let you activate launch control. So I got 2420 to 60 was my fastest, but then I realized I've got a couple extra hundred pounds of weight in this car, not including that it's including my front garden, camera gear, stuff I've got in the back from my last trip. So when I pull all that out and take this to the drag strip, I think we're gonna see very low twos, zero to sixties. And what Brooks predicted of 12, three or 10, three is definitely in range. This thing has a lot of power. And I'll tell you what, I could definitely feel the added acceleration happening beyond 60 and 70 miles an hour. It felt substantially different than before. And it's incredible how it really doesn't take all that much at this level of power to really notice a difference. So this is a really exciting update and I can't wait for the drag strip to get back open. Well, aside from Starman the Model 3 going flying, the front garden has survived the launch.